So Hannah, how did you first get into playing rugby? Uh, I started rugby quite a while ago. I started at school, in secondary school. Um, some people from my local club came in to um, sort of do a taste of rugby and it became an after school club. So I joined there and then after loving it and uh, it was actually touch rugby at school. And then when I found out that the contact rugby was a thing for women, um, for well, us girls at the time. Um, I immediately went down to my local club and was there every Wednesday until I left junior rugby and moved on to senior. Obviously, it must be fantastic for you to have Ball involved with Sales Sharks Women as our yeah. main sponsor. Being a plant-based athlete, how long have you been a vegan for? I haven't actually been a vegan for too long. Um, I sort of progressed into it. I uh, was a pescatarian. I was pescatarian. Um, about three years ago um, and then moved on to vegetarianism and then I've been a vegan for almost a year. Um, what was it that made you transition from, to a plant-based lifestyle? Uh, originally it was from an ethical standpoint so my sort of mind process was if I can't kill the animal then why do I deserve to eat it and that sort of was the, was the, was the starting point point. Um, and then from there I just started to notice more and more health benefits and the more reading up on it uh, I did the more intriguing it was. Um, it was always you know, the, the thought around being a, a vegan athlete, you always met with the ideas of how do you get enough protein, how do you keep your size big enough, things like that. Um, and I guess being able to be able to do it and try it out, I managed to sort of find ways to, to make sure that I can sort of get the quality of nutrients I need in. And since changing to this lifestyle, plant-based lifestyle, have you seen sort of positive changes to yourself and your mindset um, and yourself and your body? I have, yeah, I think, um, sort of you always hear that obviously eat, eating well has, a, has an impact on your physical and well-being but it wasn't until I actually did it and tried it that I had the evidence for myself that it really hit home like I feel like my just my mood's better my I feel healthier I have more energy they say I have more mental clarity that's a really big one for me I just um, feel more focused. Um, do you have a favourite bowl product that you use? <laughs> I do Malaysian lacto curry this is a good one nice and creamy coconut milk um, really do like a nice curry, so this one's great. And finally, how do the bowl products fit into your, your daily routine? Um, so I probably use the shakes the most, uh, just because they're really easy to, to have on the go. Um, they're a good way for me to top, top up my daily calorie intake. Um, and if I haven't been too hot on my meal, meal prep, and I've sort of been a bit slack on that, some of the ready-made meals are useful too.